Okay, so today's theme are the number two, da -da -da -dun, saying too much, saying too much. Mm. Mm -hmm. much. Okay, what's, how, how do you describe saying too much in Japanese? Too much. Uh, okay, so uh -huh. almost saying um, in English. So maybe it's a straight word. Uh -huh. It's a straight word, that's right. Okay. Um, then let me see how Andy explained first. Let, let's see my internet. Thank you. Uh, next up is too much in Japanese. To say too or too much, so too is too oh, oh, is the auxiliary of sugibu. Sugibu is too much. All you have to do to use it is attach it to the V mass stem. If you don't know what the V mass stem is, you're going to have to go back to lesson three or lesson four. We can go over it. We have to go over it in a lot of other lessons. But basically, you need to take the V mass stem and add the verb sugi. And that means too much of that verb. For a short negative version, so to say, don't do too much of something, or you not have enough on sugi. So to say, you don't eat enough. We take a short negative, we cut off the E at sa and sugi. We'll show you some examples so that makes, makes more sense. For an E adjective, all you do is cut off the E and add sugi. For an adjective, all you have to do is add sugi because there's no na in between. But basically, for adjectives, you kind of them in the negative the same way for the verbs. It be have enough of sugi means you don't need enough. But hakaku na sa sugi would be the negative of an adjective. And E adds to the particular. Yes, today's internet bad, huh? You think so, right? <laughs> Yeah, sorry, sorry, even it might a little bit challenging to hear. But anyway, what he explained is when you want to describe some things too much, what you should do, you keep on. Okay, and the auxiliary verb. Auxiliary verb, yeah. I don't know, <laughs> my, my typing always wrong. For, uh, auxiliary verb. Uh, auxiliary, 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 what do you mean by auxiliary, auxiliary verb? I think in Japanese, it says, I think like like help verb in English. Uh, <laughs> I don't I don't hear teacher saying auxiliary verb, but like okay. probably jo jodoshi. Mm -hmm. um, because you know the this part of the, yeah this part helps another part of the, uh -huh. mm -hmm, like verb. For example, like taberu plus sugiru is. Taburu mm -hmm. is obviously verb, so mm -hmm. in order to like help the tabelu's like description, auxiliary verb like follows mm -hmm. the verb. Taburu, tabesugiru, nomu, nomisugiru, mm -hmm. shaberu, shaberisugiru. Hmm, いいですね。はい。So how to make it? Ah, nomisugimasu. だから。<laughs> That's right. <laughs> you see how Japanese people think? They don't know a verb stem. But the truth is verb stem. Okay. Verb stem plus sugiru. So this ne? Verb stem plus sugiru. Yeah. There are two types of connector, like a verb and a verb connection. Um, yeah, if they, the auxiliary verb really like, uh, for me, like strongly like connect to the main verb that usually they connect verb stem mm -hmm. you know what i mean but if it's that separated the two actions we usually use te form tabe te shimau is tabiru the first action and shimau the second action kind of 
食べて見てください。食べる the first action,、mm-hmm. 見て is the second action. In that case, you usually use the te form. However, if the verb, two verbs are so closely connected, usually we take verb sam.、Mm-hmm. Osaka, Osaka ni takoyaki o tabe ni iku. So, iku and tabe ru, the action purpose is closely connected. Osaka ni takoyaki o tabe te iku means you finish takoyaki and you go to somewhere else. <laughs>、mm-hmm. Yeah. All right.、Mm-hmm. Good. So, Andy's end first point. He pointed out when you want to make negative,、mm-hmm. what, you should, what you should do. Okay, nasa sugiru. So, this. なさすぎる。It's a little bit weird why all of a sudden they like insert さ。But that's the thing. なさすぎる。Mm-hmm. But this is really、um, helpful. And it's, it's, yeah, it's important also. Okay, so for example, if you want to combine 暑いプラスすぎる。はい、みなさん書いてください。暑いプラスすぎる。<laughs> はい、暑すぎる。いいですね。But if you want to say it's not too much hot, like, it's not too much hot, you kick off. Ah, you go, but she, it's a tiku nasa sugir. A tiku nasa sugir. Okay, but okay, that's super fun, super awesome. A tiku sugir. So, no, 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 you are, you, you don't listen to my <laughs> Japanese. ちょっと待って。いや、ボアさん、Thank you, but it's not it's same as Yukiko's. ちょ、Hold on, hold on, guys. I'm saying, is n it hot today? No, it's not too hot. It's not too hot. だよ。You're gonna negate the すぎる part. あれちょっと待って。I'm sorry. あつくなさすぎる。あ Yeah, so, okay, my English is wrong. I don't know. How, how can I, how should I exp- like, describe in this English? Atsuku nasa sugiru. Atsuku nasa sugiru is like extremely not hot. Yeah, it's not, it's not too much. Okay. Just a minute. Okay. But, Atsuku nasa sugiru is like, 例えばなんか面白くなさすぎるとかはよく使える。<笑>あの映画は面白くなさすぎるとか使わない。めっちゃ面白くないという意味です。そうそうそう。面白くなさすぎる。いいですよ。オッケー。面白くないでいきますよ。今日はじゃあ。はい。面白すぎる。Too funny。面白すぎる。Too funny。面白くない。Drop E? Sa? Sa? Sugir. Hi. Omosiroku nai. Omosiroku na sa sugir. Omosiroku na sa sugir. So, Omosiroku na sa sugir. Omosiroku sugi nai. Okay. Omosiroku na sa sugir no mia nan deska mo ito English. English. Very bad. Very not. It's not too funny, じゃなくて It's too extremely not extremely not funny. Interesting. <laughs> Which means boring. はい面白くなさすぎるね。It's not too interesting. Yeah, the thanks, Lara san.、Uh, I think that it's not too interesting. It, usually we just say, あまり面白くないだよね。あまり面白くない。But we don't want to say that. あまり。Because it, it, 面白くなさすぎる is like, 面白くない the degree too much that you want to say this too much intensity. <laughs> So, omoshiroku nasa sugiru. Yes, this is the difference. Omoshiroku nai. Omoshiroku nai. Omoshiroku nasa sugiru. 
Mm -hmm. Okay, let's review the non-adjective. Okay, non-adjective, mm -hmm. for example. Mm, give me one non-adjective. Gilei. Mm -hmm. Plus sugiru. Gilei sugiru. Gilei sugiru. Mm. Mm, hi. Ja. Gilei plus negative. Plus sugiru. Okay. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. you are blaming. This is really not clean. And it, it you can't take it. That's kireijanasasugiru. Kireijanasasugiru. No, I cannot mm -hmm. be here. Kireijanasasugiru. So basically the adjective quality is too much that you cannot take it. That's the nasasugiru part. Okay, good. Mm -hmm. But there's some difference like Japanese sugiru and, for example, too much English. What do you think about it? 